Oh, I'm so happy to be back. Like I've been looking forward to this day since March, when the last group was like. Oh, it's so good to be back. I know I'm serious. Like I saw that in your body language. Oh, the level here is harder. It's harder here. Yeah. yeah right. hey, this is Melbourne, huh? Yeah. So it's Sunday morning and Sunday crits are back and it's very exciting. But before we get into this video, it's a couple of things. Firstly, I just wanted to thank all those people that have jumped on board and supported this channel. We're about four months old here and I think we've almost got 3,000 people that have hit that subscribe button. It's bloody exciting. I just wanted to thank you all for that. Additionally, if you just land on this channel, this is where I do cycling videos, both inspirational and entertaining. And I do love a deep dive road bike review, so if that sounds up your alley, consider subscribing below. Now in this video, what I wanted to do, many of my subscribers will know that I've got a goal, I wanna try and win an A grade Criterium before the end of the year, so I'm gonna try and do that today, but the scene here in Melbourne, the Criterium scene, it's pretty massive, and there's a fair bit of vibe in the air. Not only is the sun out, it's 24 degrees today, beautiful day for Criterium racing, but there's been a lot of murmuring on social media about crits are back, and in yesterday's hell ride, which is the biggest bunch ride here in Melbourne, and I'd have to say Australia, and maybe even the world, there's a lot of talk about Glenvale, which is hosted by Caulfield Carnegie, and also South Melbourne, which is where I'm headed today, hosted by St Kilda. So basically what I wanted to do was share with you what the local riders feel, what's the emotion here in Melbourne about Criterium Racing being back. Oh, you tell me, what's the emotion first crit back? How, how are you feeling? Oh, sun shining. Yeah. It's, uh, it'll be a good test through the legs, I guess. Yeah. What, what do you love about crit racing? Uh, it's over quick. It's yeah. like pulling a band-aid off, right? <laughs> Crits are back. Are you, are you racing today? Yeah. Yeah, what's the emotion? Uh, how do you feel about the I'm uh, pretty crit? excited. Yeah, yeah, pretty happy that the crowd's, uh, the crowd's actually a bit low since the round the bay's on, so yeah, yeah, yeah. it'll be a good warm-up for the day. So, yeah, yeah nice. looking forward to it. And what do you love about the crit racing down here? It's oh, just, the, you know, the club. Yeah. The club, the atmosphere, and everyone putting in and contributing. So, yeah, yeah it's nice. good. What's the emotion? The crits are back. How do you guys feel about that? Excited. Excited? Fun. Why are you excited? Because I love it. <laughs> No, How about it's yourself? Good fun. Sorry? It's good fun. Good fun? Yeah. How about yourself? What's your emotion? Yeah, back. pretty pumped. Yeah. Pretty pumped. Yeah. Big big Sunday racing's back. We're all excited. Special techniques here? Uh, it's very hard on the skinny. But, uh, Has he gone through? To, don't put the pin through to, my backside. Yeah. <laughs> so what's your emotion uh, towards the trip being back? Pretty excited. You need to go to the toilet? Yeah, yeah I need to go excited? to a, Yeah, that excited. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, what do you love about crit racing down here in Stilda? Uh, it's pretty fast, pretty exciting, and it's good competition. Yeah. Yeah, compared against the best. Post hibernation, I'm glad to be back. That's as good as good. It's Sunday, mates are here, coffee's nearby, it's sunny most of the time. Yeah. It's why we race. Yeah, nice. What's uh, your emotion? Crits are back. Well, my wife spent so long scrubbing the mud out of the, of the CX uh, <laughs> racing that. It's just good to be back, and I think she's proud that she's not going to have to be washing <laughs> mud out of my suit. <laughs> right. So Gabriel, down at the crits. Yep. You racing today? Or what no, not racing today. So I'm watching mate race. Yeah. Okay. And what's uh, what do you like about coming down to some Kilda crits? Oh, mate, it's look at this day. Yeah. It's a cracker day. Atmosphere's great. Come yeah. on, what, what's not to like, eh? What did you race today? I raced A grade today. You race A grade today. Yes. How'd you go? 
Um, was fun, very fun. I need to learn. It was my first second grade place. Alright, what did you learn? I learned that I have to be patient. Okay, right. Are <laughs> oh, you going off the front, were you? I did, yeah, yeah the whole right. way. <laughs> yeah, right. Yeah. How do you feel about the Criterion being back? Oh, it's amazing. Great atmosphere, amazing weather. Yeah. It's uh, that's what you have to do on Sunday morning. On Sunday morning. In Melbourne, yeah. In nice. Melbourne, yeah. yeah uh, we're just cheering today, just part of the public. Oh, uh, screaming and supporting this one, oh, trying nice. to tell her not to push on the front. <laughs> she just wouldn't give a damn. <laughs> oh, What's no. the emotion that comes to mind? We're back to the are we excited? Are we? Yeah, we're absolutely pumped. Oh, we're so pumped. Yeah, yeah racing today, so yeah. starting in a few minutes. Yeah, Pretty what, pumped. What are you racing? In A grade. Yeah, right. I'm not sure emotion towards the crits being back. How do you feel about it? I love the crits being back. So, yeah. you know, spring's out, summer's here, look around, how many riders there are, yeah. more people out on bikes enjoying their racing. And what do you like about being down in some field of crits? Oh, it's just the, the environment, the ambiance, it's just great. So many people, so many happy, smiley faces around. <laughs> so, Alison, what do you do at some field What's your I'm role? vice president of the You're club. You're vice president yep. of the yep. club, okay. So, how do you feel Sunday racing oh, is, Isn't it fantastic? The weather's been turned on for us. Yeah. Um, yeah. I'm excited, exhausted, yeah. <laughs> a lot of work, a lot of work to get here. Yeah. But Remember to you, thank you very much for your hard work, oh, putting this on. No, it's Feedback great. about being here is magnificent. Yeah, it's great. There's a vibe down here that you don't get in many other places. Isn't it? What do I love about it? The excitement, the buzz. <laughs> Who's going to attack next? Yeah, yeah. Troy, tell me what happened in that race in the A grade crit. Well, I think there's a lot of legs uh, wondering whether they can actually put out that much power again after the winter hibernation. And uh, I think it was a group of five went up the road and that was it. So I decided I'll just try to get a workout, get the whole bunch. I thought to myself, well, the race is gone. I might as well yell at people and do some turns. Yeah, yeah, I think, oh, well, maybe a lot of people didn't realize, but um, hey, when the race is gone, you might as well have a workout. I paid 20 bucks. <laughs> so what grade your race? C. C? How'd you go? Great. Yeah? Lots of fun. Yeah. My first race. Oh, your first race? I mean, first here in Australia, yeah. yeah. Oh, so where have you raced previously? Uh, New York. New York? Yeah, right. Yeah. So how does racing here compare to racing in New York? The level here is harder. It's harder here? Yeah. yeah right. <laughs> this is Melbourne, huh? It's amazing. There's no other place like Melbourne in terms of uh, cycling scene. Uh, race C grade with Jose, yeah, okay. who's racing New York. Yeah, how did you go? Went pretty well, I think that fourth or fifth. Oh, okay. Yeah, stayed at the, just out of the top. Yeah. Just out of the top, yeah. stayed at the front a little bit too long. Yeah. Then got boxed in at the end, but pretty happy with fourth or fifth. Yeah, nice. What's it like to be back racing in St Kilda? Sunday, Sunday racing? First time of racing in St Kilda. Oh, wow. Yeah, okay. usually just Hawthorne and Sandown. So what's the um, emotion that comes to mind? It was pretty scary. You see, the ambulance was there when we first <laughs> rocked up, but uh, yeah, it was good. C, C grades round about right. Hope to get to B grade. What did you learn today? Um, don't don't stay on the front for more than three laps. Very good lesson. Very. 
<laughs> What's going on, mate? What's going on? Not much. What's no, happening? Get it out. Oh, yeah, it was alright. Good hit out. Bit, yeah. bit rusty after the hell dog yesterday. Yeah. Good. <laughs> that was good fun. First yeah. race of the year. You're changing teams next year. So, Ben along? Can you yeah. Tell us where you're going next year? Yeah, going uh, in form next year. That's this one here? <laughs> yeah, so pretty exciting. Um, oh, I've always like known uh, the McKims and Pat's obviously my best mate, so just like a natural fit, I guess. Did yeah. you in the break in A grade? Yeah, I was. Yeah. yeah. When, when did the break actually? I was in Daydream in the back. When yeah. did it actually snap off? Pretty early. Yeah. Actually, I reckon probably the first lap, I'd say. First lap. Yeah. So I was out there by myself for about half a lap, and then. Oh. One person got across, two, three. Yeah, right. Look at that salt on the left. side of your yeah. face. I can see it there. Uh, yeah. And and um, what happened in the end? So we were kind of foxing on the last lap down the back straight. Yeah. Everyone was kind of just looking at each other, waiting to see who was going to take it up. Yeah. And I kind of took it upon myself to do that. Yeah. Okay. And, uh, I did get a gap. Uh, okay. Came into the last corner. I don't know, maybe a couple bike lengths. Oh, okay. Uh, but and then a whole bunch of breathing down your neck as well. Yeah. Well, ex exactly. And uh, I almost had it, but uh, just I don't have much of a kick, so yeah, right. just couldn't hold it to the line. Oh, well. so, Good effort, mate. Well thanks. done. Thanks. Cheers. Uh, fifth. Fifth? Oh, yeah. Okay. You're in the break, were you? Oh, yes. Right. Oh, I don't know how. <laughs> <laughs> how did that go? First um, race back in the break. That must have hurt. It was. For me, it did hurt. But um, we, we were riding smoothly. And I think that was the, uh, the key for us to be able to stay away. But um, it felt like riding in the North Road ride on Tuesday. Yeah, right. so, and last lap was um, foxing around. Yeah, right. And uh, they jumped around the back, and uh, I'm not a sprinter, so I basically tried to do my best. Just um, pull your legs up, right? Yeah, fifth, so, so I'm happy for, an old, for an old dog. Yeah, yeah well, what's I'm the emotion being back at Sunday racing? Oh, it's good to be back. Got the winner of A grade here. Mate, tell me what happened. Um, in the break the whole time? I bridged to it with Pat Eddie. Yeah, okay. We ended up coming second with 20 minutes to go. Yeah, I mean, okay. <laughs> you're exhausted. <laughs> As to be expected. We bridged over 20 minutes in, yep. and then we were just basically pulling half lap turns the whole way, came down to the sprint and managed to roll Pat. Yeah, so, right. By how much? Oh, half a rim. Yeah, right. Yeah, it was pretty close. How do you feel about winning? Pretty happy. Pumped? Yeah. Re retire for the season now? <laughs> nah. <laughs> I'll be back next week. <laughs> yeah, nice. And what's, but, it, what's it like to be back at Sunday racing? Oh, it's great. It's best time of the year by far. Yeah. Love the crit season. All right, so I've just popped down to Omara's for a post-race coffee, and I've just bumped into somebody who's been racing Glenvale. In fact, one C grade? One C grade today. Can you tell me, how was Glenvale today? Good to be back racing? Yeah, good to be back racing. Love racing the crits. Yeah? What do you love about it? Oh, just getting out there and smashing myself. Yeah? Good nice. fun, yeah. And how'd you go today? Uh, I got the win. Yeah, I went solo for about 20 minutes and then got caught. And then went with the counter and it stuck. And two up sprint for the win. Yeah, right. So how much you win by? Oh, bike length. Bike Not much. Right. But yeah. Is that your first win, C-grade? Uh, yeah, first win in a while. Yeah, right. So you're going to be up in B now? You yeah, up in B grade. Up in B? Yeah. How does that feel? Oh, it's good. Almost at A. Oh, that's awesome. Yeah, make it a bit that's awesome. Alright, so I've just finished my post post race coffee at Omara's and now a legend of the Caulfield Carnegie Cycling Club has just walked through the door. <laughs> Mick, he's a Australian Olympian cyclist as well by the way. And he was down at Glenvale today. So Mick, tell me what was uh, well it was pretty good. It was uh, excellent day. Was it good feeling? racing? Lots of brakes I hear. Oh lots of brakes, yeah, there's a break that it looks like it was going to actually lap the field, lap the rest of the A graders, but they, uh, the uh, the bunch actually got their act together and really started to get into it, yeah. and uh, so they they actually they never caught them, but uh, it was a great great race. Yeah, right. Everyone had a good workout. The, yeah. The back bunch, uh, the bunch were chasing. Really got stuck into each other. There was gaps forming in the back bunch. If you if you didn't know there was a breakaway, you swear this was the race. Yeah, right. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. yeah, well, there's the church. That's yeah. Sunday, Sunday morning at Glenvale. I've been, <laughs> well, I've been going there for the last 40 years or something, I think. So. Yeah, right. <laughs> and, um, oh, no, it is. It's brilliant, brilliant yeah. stuff. This is your first crit race yes. that you've seen, you watched. Nick actually wrote me down to get down to the Glenvale crits. Yeah, and okay. uh, I've seen it on YouTube all the time. I've seen Carnegie's Courtfield promoting it. Yeah. So, Mick's promoting it to me. First right. crit. So how do you so know I, li I live 
just two kilometers away from Glenvale. Oh, right, yeah. okay. Interesting. And what were your thoughts on the first crit? Oh, there was so much enthusiasm in the air. Everyone's so excited because it's crit season again. Yeah? Yeah, everyone's like... Has it inspired you to get down there? Yeah, it has. I might race next week. Yeah? Seeing me going so fast around the corners, I'm like, oh, I've got to be down there. <laughs> oh, I'm going to be down there. All right, so the first Sunday crits are done and dusted. And I wanted to share with you my personal emotion. I've asked a lot of people that today, what their emotion is towards the crits being back. And because I've had a bit more time to think about this one than everyone else, I just shoved the camera in their face today. I'm sure they all share this similar emotion, and that is I'm super grateful. I'm super grateful for the clubs and all the volunteers that enable us to go Sunday racing, because for me, Sunday racing makes me feel like a kid again, which is just super good for my mental and my physical health. So massive thank you to all the volunteers and clubs out there. Two things I learned today, number one, never assume something's gonna happen in a crit race. I didn't think a break was gonna go, particularly in the first 20 minutes, just because St Kilda's a bit of a, it's like a track. Seldomly does a, a break go, it's very hard for a break to go, and it was a beautiful day today, it was a big bunch, and it did, went in the first part of the race. So, that was the first thing I learned. The second thing I learned was that I just love Sunday crit racing. I'll catch you in the next video.